So today we're going to be checking out the other half to this Winter Wonderland update, which is a Gotcha Claws. We checked out Raptor Claws yesterday, we got lots of presents, and we've got lots of mistletoe and coal, which is what you're going to need for Gotcha Claws. Guys, uh, <laughs> this skin is so silly. I love it. I think the community is just going crazy over this new skin. We need more stuff like this, you know, just weird ass stuff like this needs to be added to the game. Um, yeah, yesterday when I was doing the video for, uh, for Raptor Claws, I actually found a Gotcha Claws over here, and I was like, okay, cool, I'll just come over here, and, uh, and then I'll trade with this one for that video. This one over here is a 162, which I'm not sure if that makes a difference on level, but then on my way over here today, I spotted down here, there are three of them all together, and I actually haven't checked their levels, to be honest. So we've got a 114, and then I like this blue one over here, actually. He's really cool. A 102 and then a level 18. I don't know if it makes a difference uh, what level they are, depending, like, I don't know if that's gonna, like, give me better loot if I go for a better level one or not. I'm really unsure about that, but I think it might do, actually. We need to do some testing. What you wanna do is you gotta go right up to Gotcha Claws and you gotta basically put uh, mistletoe or coal or both into its inventory. It's gonna eat it and it's gonna produce some crystals for you and then from those crystals, you can get a bunch of loot and then the new chibis as well. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do here today. Guys, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. Meant to do this, there we go, boom, yeah. <laughs> So strange. Oh man. All right. Let's see. Um, let's give you. Let's just give you half of that coal for the moment then. So it works the exact same as a normal gotcha. I don't believe you need to give it owl pellets at all because, as you can see, it's got the good sparklies on the back right here. And uh, you cannot tame these dudes, but you can, of course, go right up to them and just access their inventory. What did we get? I wonder. Give me that. So with every single feed, it's gonna eat ten coal or ten mistletoe. And uh, from that crystal, we get, we got a mammoth chibi. Cool. All right. That's nice. Uh, I actually meant to, I have the uh, survivor skin thing he's on. I actually meant to turn that off. I just realized I accidentally kept the uh, little noglin one. Let's go ahead and just turn that off real quick. Uh, that is right in here. And that's basically how you get this, uh, <laughs> this poglin skin. It's so stupid. I love it, but it's so stupid looking. All right. What do we get from this one? Uh, boom. We got, ah, oh, we got a party hat. Okay, I'm gonna drop that on the ground. I don't really want that. Um, so yeah, you can get a lot of crap from these things, obviously. Um, I don't know if it's gonna give us like weapons and stuff, to be honest, but we gotta see. Uh, it might be better using, oh wait, no, look at that. Yeah, okay, so level can't make a difference because its crafting skill is only 100 there. That means that it's probably not worth trying to go for a better one or whatever. We got a gift box, cool. So let's just place that down here. And uh, let's open that. Cool. I got some mistletoe from that. Sweet. All right. Let's see. What are we going to get here? Uh, so maybe what we should do is we should head down to the three of them together. And then that way we can get more crystals all at once. That one is an apprentice crystal, which means... Oh, we got a little candy thing. Cool. Maybe I'll go ahead and chuck that onto the snow owl. We can just take off the skin for the moment. Uh, there you go, buddy. There's your... Oh, that's actually some half-decent colors. I like that, actually. All right. Let me grab the missile or the coal out of this dude and um let's see let me just grab all that out did he already eat some i'm not sure if he already ate some or not oh is he gonna yeah there we go sweet we got another apprentice one so what we're gonna do here today is we're just gonna trade with the gotcha clauses um let's go down to these guys here and try to get lots of them all at once uh along with that maybe we'll try and hit up some more raptor claws drops i'm not sure where the other one's gone has it gone over this way I think you can pick these guys up. I reckon he's probably fallen off the cliff or something. Uh, you can pick these. You can pick these guys up. I'm pretty sure with Quetzals and and Wyverns. I do have both on me just to test it. So uh, let's go ahead and do that real quick then. Uh, boom. And then let me see. Let's drop you out. Can we pick up these gotcha clauses? Wait, no, you can't. I wasn't able to right there. Maybe you can only do it with a Quetzal. That might be a thing. Yeah, I'm not able to pick up gotcha claws unless maybe it's just messing up let's just head over for this one this one's in like a better area to grab it in uh, oh there's the other one let me see if i can pick up this one i can bring it down to the other two uh okay let's see let me yeah you cannot pick them up with wyverns let's test this out with uh we got some compies about to attack me here we gotta probably kill these guys with my brand new pike this thing's dope by the way it's ascendant and there's the damage right there 332 pretty amazing 
pretty freaking good. We got that uh, out of Raptor Claws drops. Um, we're not being attacked anymore, are we? Cool. All right, so let's test this out with a Quetzal then. Let's see if we can pick this dude up. I assume if we can't pick them up with these guys, a Skiff would at least work. Let's see. Uh, okay, I picked up the Fiomia. Okay, let me just move this real quick. There we go. Boom. Uh, okay, can we pick up... Yes, we can. All right, so you can't do it with a Wyvern. I thought you might have been able to, but uh, yeah, clearly you can pick them up with the Quetzal. So if you wanted to, you could go ahead and just make a giant compound with like tons of these dudes. I, I really don't think that having multiple ones around like that really makes a difference. As you can see, they've all got the good color sparkles on their back. With normal gotchas, you don't want more than one of the same gender, basically. So yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and give you some mistletoe. And then I'll put some coal into the other two. And we could just get lots of crystals all at once here. And in the meantime, let me just tell you guys that something extremely exciting happened yesterday. Um, we got the keys. We got the keys to my new home. Um, I got to say, it, was, it felt really strange. Did I already give you some? I think I might have. It felt really strange to get the keys finally. Um, we've been trying to get this house for like months now. And banks and everything have been really really slow and and just it, the whole process has just been kind of awful realistically like trying to get a house as you're self-employed uh especially with something like youtube it's really difficult to do i don't know how these giant youtubers do it like i reckon they just flat out buy houses i am not capable of doing that um so yeah we had to get a mortgage but uh, uh yeah it was it was kind of awful trying to explain to banks yeah this is what i do and then they're like well is there sustainability and then they don't really see that so yeah the whole process was really just awful i i didn't enjoy it but we finally got through everything and we finally got the house and it's beautiful and it excites me so much because it's just i don't know like we're gonna have this amazing home by the way i'm not really finding any crystals off of those guys so maybe we need to go to a different area or something because I, I feel like a crystal dropped but i just didn't see it so yeah um but yeah the, the whole process was was difficult to get through but uh we're through and and now you know we're in the stage where we're gonna try and start moving close to the new year uh maybe in the start of january i might take a little bit of a break from youtube just so i can get uh my bearings and and build up the new office and everything and it's gonna be fantastic and i will obviously show you guys uh stuff along the way um don't fall off the cliff you know what give me give me this stuff back i'm gonna go to the one up the hill because this area is not great um so yeah, we, we're gonna have like a, a lovely office. I can't wait. Um, I'll probably try and update my Instagram a little bit with some photos and everything. So if you guys are interested in that, follow the Instagram. Let me see, did I already grab it out of you? I think I did, let me grab it out of you. This is an awful area to do this in. I, I don't wanna do it here. <laughs> so yeah, um, I just wanna say thank you to, to the whole fan base here. Like uh, obviously I wouldn't have been able to do this if I didn't have such an amazing fan base and community and everything. So just thank you guys. Like, it's, it's really, it's really crazy. <laughs> it truly is. So yeah, um, super exciting. Honestly, just, just thrilled and, and just really, really proud and, and just everything. Yeah, it's, it's great. <laughs> Don't know what else to say. Oh man, uh, where's this guy? There you are. <laughs> Let's open up some of these crystals here. Once I drop in some coal or whatever. Uh, let me drop in. Yeah, we'll just drop in all that coal all at once. All right, let's see. What do we get? Candy again. Journeyman sword, okay. Party hat, uh, birthday suit, and then another candy. All right, so a lot of crap from these, to be honest. Like, I don't, I'm not a big fan of the candy stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and just drop some of these skins as we get them, because they're not really that useful. Can I place that just anywhere, or do I actually have to put that onto an actual wall? Let me see. Can this go over here? Eh, let's see. No, damn it, that would have been cool. All right, I know he dropped another crystal. I'll grab it now once I find it. There it is. Boom. Alrighty. So, yeah, we're just going to chill around with Gotcha Claws for a little bit. Let it eat all of these goodies that I've been giving it. We will definitely need to hit up Raptor Claws a little bit more and grab more drops. So, uh, yeah, I'll just collect up a bunch of crystals and we'll crack them all open at once in a few minutes. So, this is pretty handy. What you can do is you can go ahead and just pick up the Gotcha with the Quetzal and then just uh, hold it like above an area and then just have it rain crystals down there. If you have another tribe mate, it would make it easy because they can pick up the crystals and you don't have to hop off or, or you know, whatever, like occasionally. But uh, yeah, that's pretty handy, actually. I'm really, 
really like that you can actually do it this way. It looks so strange when you're holding it, though, and then it just sits down in midair. <laughs> All right, so yeah, we're, uh, I think, maybe seven or eight more crystals to go, and then we can crack open all these. We've got a good amount so far, so yeah, see you guys in a few minutes here. All right, so we're going to drop him down there, and let's pick up all these crystals. Let's see. Boom. Okay, so we got all of those, and yeah, he's eaten all of the coal, actually. Interesting, because I thought he'd have, like, a little bit left. We had, like, 77 at one point. Hmm, maybe, maybe I looked at it wrong. I'm not sure. All right, so we've got quite a few crystals here. I think the easier way of doing this is to just put everything else into here, maybe, and then just crack and open all of them out at once here. Uh, let's do that. And then, yeah, let's just, just mass open all of these. Okay. Oh, okay. That's, yeah. It <laughs> started hitting things. Oh, we got some bulb dogs. Cool. Uh, let's just type in cry. So crystal, obviously. There we go. All right, so what do we get? We got bulb dog chibis, very nice. Um, some other random chibis that I probably already have. A new skin. Uh, we don't really need those though. Like they, they, they're all like attached to achievements. I already have those. Like I could get these for free if I ever need them. But um, yeah, we got a couple of little presents. This is cool. We can go ahead and just crack and crack open all of these. Um, we got a torch for some reason. It's just just like a regular. Okay, no, they're like uh. They're like half decent ones or whatever. Let's just crack these open. It will give me some mistletoe. And we got 10 of them as well. So makes it a little bit nice because now I can feed one more time. Uh, I can feed gotcha claws one more time. Come on. Unless one of these has like extra in it, which I don't think they do really. All right, let me go ahead and just pop this mistletoe in there. Uh, we've got some other random decorations and stuff. I think you can craft all that stuff anyway. Um, and then, yeah, let's check out these new bulb dog chibis then. So let's put this one on first. And, oh, that is, that is a big chibi. <laughs> that almost looks like an actual bulb dog. All right. Uh, in terms of size, obviously, I knew it, it's technically a bulb dog, but like, I mean like the actual size of it. Oh, this is a cool look. Oh yeah, this is the one. This is the bulb dog. Look at that. So now we have the little glow tail and the bulb dog. Um, I like that color though. That's definitely a good one. Uh, let's go ahead and crack open this crystal real quick. What do we get? Uh, okay, cool. So yeah, like you get a lot of a lot of like random crap out of the gotcha claws. So it's it's definitely not um, super worth it. But if you want all the new chibis and stuff, it, it's probably worth doing this. I love I love the bulb dog. <laughs> That's a good chibi. Like there's a lot of chibis and some of them are like mad, but this is definitely a good one. I like that a lot. Let's see. What does it look like when I run? Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, that's a great chibi. I love that. All right. So, we clearly need to start hitting up the um the uh raptor claws drops when midnight when midnight rolls around. I can do that and uh and hopefully get some more like freaking coal and and mistletoe and everything. It's not super easy to actually get all this stuff. You know, you obviously got to be hunting down the raptor claws drops constantly. So, um, yeah, definitely not the easiest thing to do. Let's just go ahead and pull everything out, and then I'll go ahead and put you away, and then I can pull you down. Oh, I just got rid of the colors off of it, didn't I? Eh, it's fine. I don't really care too much about the color, and there's nothing in here, right? Yeah. So, now we know where there's a, a couple good gotcha clauses. We can go ahead and just wait for midnight and, and then do another round of these drops and hopefully we can get some really good stuff along with some of the other chibis there's still quite a few more i think there's five more that i need we have the shine horn we have the feather light and then there's the reindeer uh gotcha claws one and then there's one more that i can't remember right now and i don't know what it is but yeah it's it's something so yeah i'll see you guys in a little bit hopefully we can get some of those um yeah <laughs> All right, so we got another night of Raptor Claws drops. Luckily, I was able to find it pretty quick. And yeah, we're going to grab all these, obviously. Um, one thing I want to mention is if you guys missed it, I put out a quick video on a brand new Genesis Part 2 creature that was revealed, the Maywing. And it, it's honestly one of the strangest things they're ever adding to Ark. I mean, you guys need to check it out. I'll probably try to leave a link down below. It's... Oh, it's so strange. But yeah, watch that video if you want to know about that creature. Um, hopefully this video does not suppress that one. Sometimes that can happen. All right, so we just got to wait for this to come down completely. Hopefully they're not going to attack me. 
Um, but yeah, we're going to hit up all these drops and hopefully get some more mistletoe and good loot. Oh no, they're attacking. What the hell is happening? There's so many gotcha clauses around here. Look, there's three here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. All in like the same area. Like what on earth is happening? There's like an overspawn of them. <laughs> I don't even understand it. This doesn't even include all the ones, you know, that we have over here. We have our one on the bridge and then we have another three over there. Like what the hell? I mean, this area is always flooded with creatures, but like eight of them all in the same spot is super weird. And I guarantee one or two of them have probably already died. Uh, let's see. All right. So we still got you over here. Let me go ahead and just check out the stuff. So I didn't really actually pay too much attention when we were grabbing this stuff. But I know that we did get another uh, glow tail chibi. Very cool. Let me just check out the color on it uh, compared to the, the, uh, the one that we had before. I think that was probably the one that we had before, I think. And then we've got this other one uh yeah both kind of like meh not not super amazing colors let's switch back to the bulb dog because that one's really good uh i think it's the other one right is that it i can't really tell it's super hard to tell with this lighting and everything i think that might be the one that we like so yeah um let me see we get anything good yeah a lot of gilly again a lot of gilly uh oh my god oh my holy that is a really good saddle Wow, that is an insane saddle. By the way, once again, I do not increase loot quality on my server. So that's insane. Holy crap, 143. Uh, people would probably love this. Well, no, people would definitely love this for official. Like, and that's a blueprint. That is ridiculously good. You could easily push... 180 close to 200 if you crafting skilled that's ridiculous oh my god all right well that that's amazing um we definitely got to make one of those at some point yeah uh, a lot of basic stuff i mean we can grind some of this stuff which is nice um this saddle here is really good but it's a pachyrhinus saddle so meh uh yeah cool all right well yeah i think we're gonna go ahead and just feed what mistletoe we have and where's the coal Coals up here. Cool. So yeah, we have we have enough for like 15 crystals out of this dude. Um, let's go ahead and just do that. I don't think he eats or gives crystals if it's just one. Um, so, so yeah, we'll just like hold on to that last piece. I think he has to eat like a full 10. All right, so we've got all these crystals. Let's just drop everything into here and cry. Let's. There we go. Okay, so we're just going to go ahead and copy that and then paste that in here and then put that there and then crack open all these. All right, we got to send it something there. Um, okay, so we got some actual loot. Oh, that's a good chibi. I don't think I had that one already. Nice. Um, yeah, so some pretty good stuff. We got an ascended candy, which is cool. A couple of Mastercraft ones too. Um, yeah, like some half decent stuff here. You know, like these are these are pretty good. Definitely not bad at all. Uh, these aren't really great. I'll probably end up grinding a lot of the stuff that I'm getting out of this update, to be honest. I would say that they have decreased the loot quality this year because it doesn't seem as good. It just doesn't seem uh, like the way it used to be. Like, I, I feel like it was definitely a little bit more OP last year. So just just my thought, but uh, I don't know. Oh, that's a nice. I like that bunny. That's a really nice color. Actually, you know what? I think we already actually had one of these. I think we might have had one of those. I'm not sure feel like we did though um but yeah that's uh some half decent loot nothing really insane besides like that stego saddle but that's not even from gotcha claws so gotcha claws gives some half decent okay-ish stuff that you could probably end up just grinding to be honest i mean like most of it's like mess so i don't know it's up to you but uh personally yeah most of this stuff will just end up going into the grinder anyway uh, yeah, anyway, guys, I feel like that's probably going to be it for this video. Probably a bit of a shorter one. There's not a whole lot to do with Gotcha Claws, and it's pretty grindy. You know, you got to do the uh, the drops with Raptor Claws, and then you got to come over and feed Gotcha Claws. So it's pretty good, but uh, I'm going to obviously try to work on getting the rest of these chibis. I just don't know how long it's going to take until I have at least some of them, if not all of them. What I'll probably end up doing with a lot of these extra ones is just re-rolling them in a furnace, and then maybe I might potentially be able to get some of these other ones. But um, 
yeah, I think that's it for today. If you guys have enjoyed the video, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button, and um, yeah, check out the, the Maywing video, and then also the Raptor Claws video if you missed that one, and uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.